Hey, 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 hello, my friend. How are you today? Welcome. Thanks a lot for being here. My name is Amner Hunter. A pleasure to be here sharing with uh, this other video with you guys. Got a quick one for you today. The company IK Multimedia in partnership with Audio Plugin Deals. Uh, they are giving away for free um, for a limited time this cool synthesizer based uh, in the Juno 60 by Roland. Uh, right, a legendary synthesizer and this um, emulation by IK Multimedia sounds great. Before we begin with the content, let me invite you quickly to my website, amnerhunter.com, where I have some additional freebies for you, such as some free PDF guides and ebooks for music producers and guitar players about mixing with free plugins, about how to make more music in less time, also productivity hacks for your home studio. Additionally, I have some tools such as some collections of guitar impulses, some collections of drum sample packs, among other utilities. And finally, don't forget to check out this channel or my blog, which I am updating almost daily with content like this, all right? Uh, regarding all of the uh, news regarding freebies and deals and stuff, right? I'm gonna leave you the link in the video description and first comment uh, for you to follow to get this cool freebie by IK Multimedia, all right? Also, I'm gonna leave you timestamps in case that you're watching this video after the live stream ends or you are re-watching the video or something. So this is gonna be um, I'm gonna do a quick uh, demo of some some of the sounds. We're gonna go quickly through some of the main features of this synth plugin and also walk you through the steps to get it installed on your computer. Right? Let me know if you are here in the live chat. I see here acoustic. As always, my friend. Hello. Uh, thanks for being here. I appreciate it. Good to be here as well, sharing this info with you guys. So um, let's uh, go here, let's check out some sounds and before we move on with the installation and stuff, all right? So, okay, so I have the plugin set and ready here in my DAW. The moment that you open up the plugin or the virtual instrument, this is the main window, right? right? You get a ton of presets here from the different uh, synths that are included in this uh, Syntronic by IK Multimedia. You have the categories here, brass, chromatic, electric piano, organ, sound effects, strings, synth bass, synth lead, synth pad, etc, etc, right? And uh, I don't know about you, but I you usually start with presets and go from there when it comes to synths. Uh, because I am not a synth guy, I'm not an expert on this, so I basically start with the presets because they are very well crafted and they are crafted by better people than than me, right? <laughs> so uh, here at the left you have also the different synths that are available, 69, I'm sorry, 99, Blau, Bully, DCOX, Galaxy, Harpy 260, the J60, of course, the Juno 60, legendary synth uh, made in the 80s by Roland, right? Uh, and the Mini Mod Noir, Noir, Oxa, Polymorph, Pro V, Sam String Box, T03, and V80. Amazing, amazing stuff, right? So if you click on one plugin, you're gonna get the presets for that specific plugin, right? Here are in yellow the presets that I have selected, but if we deselect everything here, I'm gonna get only the presets for that specific synth, right? So I have here the DZ, okay. So for instance, the 99, right? So you double click in any of these presets loads quickly and okay you have all of the features to uh, reshape the sounds within here with this interface okay and you have here more sounds
you have also volume panning master here you have also this rack uh, channel strip eq compression and this whole reverb right you can also add uh well that those are the only two things that you can add reverb and channel strip and what is this okay and where the instrument or all of the sounds are installed and this i guess okay i, I don't know a lot of, about this to be honest but anyway it this is a quick uh just a rundown of of the the plugin right so let's move here to all right to the where is the synth here okay so more let's check out some sounds off of the j60 these are like the banks right a b c and d all right j60 strings light amazing sounds here on all of this synth collection pro v this one all right that's the syntronic a uh, collection of synthesizers uh, by IK Multimedia, all right? Let's uh, go through the installation process, which is kind of a, a hassle, to be honest, uh, you know, about IK Multimedia. Um, but let's do that anyway. I'm not going to do it live, but I'm going to walk you through all of the process that I followed, right? All righty, so... Uh, let's begin here it took me about uh, 15 minutes to install fully install and activate this um, this software on my computer and I'm gonna walk you through those steps right here so you go to the audio plugin deals uh, website yeah right you have the promo here so the plugin uh, will be yours forever but this free promo um, is for two weeks only right but you're gonna keep the the freebie after this um, period ends so you add this product to the cart as if you were purchasing the product you're gonna have it here in the cart right you click on checkout and you finish the process of uh, like purchasing quote unquote the plugin with your it's gonna ask you for your name a valid email address um, it's if you don't have an account it's gonna ask you to create an account and stuff but I suggest you to create an account and enter um, uh, with your session here at audio plugin deals uh, after that you're gonna uh, finish the process order received and you're gonna get an email uh, that looks like this a confirmation of your of your order right at audio plugin deals and they're gonna give you this authorization number serial number and you're gonna have to uh, they mm, give you the link for the authorization manager right you go here to the IK multimedia website you download the authorization manager for Windows or Mac you install it right like that execute the file install it you're gonna finish the execution uh, of the file the installation 
and then you go look on your computer for the authorization manager and it's gonna open something like this <coughs> right welcome to the IK multimedia <coughs> product authorization manager click next you enter enter with your credentials uh, so that's why it's very important to have an account at IK multimedia right with username and password you click next and the, the serial number the authorization number that audio plugin deals provided you you're gonna paste it here and uh, click next and it's gonna validate that serial number right and you're gonna get another email address that looks like this uh, dear Amner thank you for registering your product serial number blah 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 getting started and you're gonna go to the user area at AK Multimedia's website here you're gonna have the link for that you're gonna load you're gonna log in here with your same credentials right username and password and a uh, under your your products you're gonna have added the Syntronic 2 J60 uh, here on your account right you have the serial number the one that you provided so it's authorized now after this you're gonna have to download the IK product manager right uh, this is where the installation and activation happens before it was only the 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 download and authorization this is the installation itself so you download IK product manager for Windows and Mac you install that file execute it and stuff and it's gonna open up this window uh, you enter again with your credentials from IK Multimedia, username and password. And you're going to have this window, right? Welcome Abner Hunter. And you click on manage my products. And you're going to scroll a bit uh, here uh, down and you're going to find the Syntronic, right? So you click on install and it's going to start installing. It's uh, 1.2 gigabytes. So you wait a, a little bit for that and then it's going to pop up some uh, windows like like this uh, to install it like uh, you're going to install the cons you're going to install the custom shop so next you click on next and stuff and also accept the agreement you're going to install as well as the custom shop you're going to install the Centronic instrument itself right so click on next and you're going to have now the VST plugin in different formats uh, for Pro Tools, VST3, VST plugin, and standalone. There is also a standalone. So you click next, it's gonna install the plugin and it's gonna finish the process. And um, you already have the the plugin installed and authorized. Here it says uh, nine authorizations left. Uh, it means that you have you can install up to ten times this this instrument on on like. 10 different computers for instance uh, something like that right I have nine authorizations left because I already used this one so once that it's installed and authorized uh, you are good to go right you open up your DAW just look for Centronic or IK Multimedia and you're gonna find it uh, there right so that's pretty much it my friend uh, let me know what you think of this sounds of this uh, J60 let me know what you think of uh, IK Multimedia. I know it's a um, hassle, but uh, IK Multimedia creates uh, great products uh, nonetheless. But I'm not, uh, I don't agree with that um, process of installation and stuff. It's uh, kind of long. A lot of people get confused and a lot of people have problems with it. But anyway, I have done this many times, so <laughs> I have practice with this. Nicholas. Nicholas says here, nice one, Amner. Happy Friday. Happy Friday, Nicholas. Happy Friday for you guys as well. Sound of the Garden says, awesome, brother. Acoustic, I'm going to try it out. Yeah, check it out, Acoustic. If you if you are not afraid of following that, that long process. But it took me about 15 minutes to in install the whole thing. You also need to restart the computer uh, once the installation finished. Uh, a great great synth indeed says nicholas i agree with you i never had problems with ik multimedia me neither you know uh 
that that's the only thing i i have never had problems with ik multimedia the i usually install everything just following every step and i don't have any problems the, their products sound great which is the most important thing but anyway i thought you wanted to know about this uh, cool news today my friend thanks a lot for watching uh, before we go let me invite you quickly to my website amnerhunter.com where i have some additional freebies for you such as some free pdf guides and ebooks for music producers and guitar players also some free tools such as some collections of guitar impulses some collections of drum sample packs among other utilities and finally don't forget to be checking out this channel or this blog which i am updating almost daily with content like this all right thanks a lot for watching again i appreciate your time here um nice one under <coughs> the focus right and ik multimedia in last two days i know man <laughs> um we're not we are not gonna know what to do with a lot of these freebies right um all right guys take care bye bye i uh, will see you very soon right bye bye